Coming up next is a special address on innovation in MCL in the age of digital technology by Mr. O.P. Singh, Chairman Come Managing Director, Mahanadi Coalfield Limited. Mahanadi Coalfield Limited, MCL, is one of the major coal producing companies of India. It is one of the eight subsidiaries of Coal India Limited. Let's hear more from Mr. Singh on innovations in MCL. Welcome, Mr. Singh. Pleasure to have you here. Over to you. A very warm welcome to all my fellow panelists from Coal Fraternity of MCL. I am honored to be invited in this panel discussion and to offer my views on this subject. The subject is innovation in central and state PSUs in the age of digital technology. As all you know that in this era, where internet has become one of the basic needs for survival, from digital payment to the new frontiers of artificial intelligence and machine learning. Industries have evolved to carry out their day-to-day -day business in a very fast, efficient, and transparent manner. The central and state PSUs too are not untouched with these digital revolutions in conducting their business. Mahanadi Coal Fields Limited, a central PSU under the Ministry of Coal, has continued to evolve and transform into the biggest coal producing company of the country with an absolute coal production of 168 million ton and supply of dry fuel to the tune of 176 million ton during last financial year, that is 2021-22. MCL is carrying out majority of its business digitally while adopting the best innovative and environmentally sustainable practices. So few of the initiatives taken by MCL to make it a leading coal producing company in the country is that uh, we produce our 96% of the coal production through surface miner. Surface miner is uh, eco-friendly and uh, modern technology for mining of coal in which drilling, blasting, and uh, loading, multiple loadings are avoided, and uh, the product is gets prepared at the face itself, which is ready for disposal, ready for dispatching to the customer for direct use. And MCL at the same time doing eco-friendly dispatch also. Last year we have dispatched 176 million ton of coal, out of which 73% was through rail. And rest of the production was through road mode. In MCL, we are in the process of implementing 11 FMC projects that uh, amounts that quantifies to 165 million ton of dispatch and uh, the total capital involved to implement these projects will be 3,900 crores. By implementing these projects, we will dispatch through rapid loading system, which are eco-friendly and very efficient way of dispatching coal. In MCL, we are going to develop very good uh, rail infrastructure and we have taken up two major rail projects one is jharsugra barpali sardega railway line with a capital investment of 3200 crores this investment will facilitate dispatch of about 100 million ton from basundra coal field another rail project 
we are taking up through ncrl mahanadi coal rail limited a subsidiary of coal india a subsidiary of mahanadi coal fields limited in which 55 kilometers of railway track in phase 2 and 14 kilometers of railway track in phase 1 is going to be constructed with a total capital of 1700 crores the construction of this project will facilitate evacuation from talchir coal field in mcl we are procuring our goods and services through e procurement mode only our all coal production contract coal transportation contracts ov removal wagon loading materials management and all procurement of all services are through e procurement mode only in mcl we have uh, achieved a very good uh, procurement level from gem last year mcl have procured goods and services of 214 crores out of total procurement of about 500 crores and we have been ranked as second psu in the country in overall ranking in gem procurement in mcl we have implemented erp system also where our all business activities are through enterprise resource planning software and it is in the stage of implementation and we are the leading subsidiary company in coal india to implement this erp system and uh, we have implemented vehicle tracking system in mahanadi coal fields limited our all transports are monitored through this system and the real time vehicle movement are captured this helps us in uh, protecting the company from theft of coal we are we have implemented khanar prahari app also which is used for reporting of any theft taking place in the in the company we have innovation cell also which look after new developments taking place in the in the industry and adopting them for our for our technological uh, development in the field of technological intervention that transformed the functioning of mcl few of the technologies i would like to mention here one of them is blast free technology so in this technology we have deployed surface miner which is producing 96% of our production and in coal india this production by surface miner is 50% of cis surface miner production we have also introduced vertical reapers for ob removal in two of the mines where the workings have reached to a uh, very near to the village so blasting is avoided and our ob removal work is continuing it is also first time introduced in coal india and we are the leading company in uh, introducing this vertical reaper in the field of effective dust separation mcl has done a uh, very good work and we have deployed fog cannons of 100 meter throw which are 120 in numbers they are fixed deployed at our coal stocks at sidings where this coal handling activity is going on we have got mobile fog fog cannons also which are 18 in numbers they have got the throw of 40 meter so they are used on the transport roads to suppress the dust we have for dust uh, removal we have mechanical road sweepers 
they are truck mounted and they are eight in numbers deployed in various mines of NCL. In the field of firefighting also, we have developed robotic nozzles and quadrajet nozzles for firefighting. The role of MCL in energy security of the nation is also quite commendable. Coal India has produced 622 million tons last year. Out of this, the share of MCL has been 168 million tons. That is about 27% of the coal India's production. And in dispatch front, Mahanadi Coal Fields Limited has dispatched 176 million ton of coal. Out of this, dispatch to the power plants has been 127 million ton. And this dispatch has registered a growth of 30% over last year, 30% over its previous year. And the next year's target for coal production is 176 million ton. For OB removal, the target is 208 million meter cube. And for dispatch, it is 176 million ton. And we have got a stock of 16.5 million ton. And uh, this production and this stock level will be able to meet the country's requirement in power generation and for other consumers. On an average, we are loading about 90 racks per day, which, is, uh, which has got a substantial share in total rack dispatch from Coal India. Now regarding future plans of Mahanadi Coal Fields Limited, we are going to implement three MDO projects totaling to 85 million ton of production. Out of this two MDO projects, that is Siarmal, 50 million ton, and Subhadra, 25 million tons. The LOI has been issued, means the MDO operator has been shortlisted and work has been awarded to them. The total value of the contract for Siarmal is 3,600 crores, and for Subhadra, it is 3,100 crores. Another MDO project of 10 million ton, that is Balbhadra, is going to be finalized in coming days. And in future plans, we are going to implement big rail projects and massive improvement in our rail dispatch system. So these big projects are Sardega, Charsugda rail line, in which we are doubling the railway track, laying the double leg flyover at Charsugda, and concentric bulbs of seven concentric circles, in which about 70 million ton of coal will be dispatched through RLS system. And the total dis investment will be 3,200 crores in this project. Another project for rail line development is Angul Barram link phase one and phase two is Barram Jharpada Tentulai link. The total cost of these two projects is 1700 crores. We have also taking up, we are also taking up auto signaling system in Talsir network, rail network where we are going to develop five rail overbridge and doubling of various railway tracks for which the cost of about 360 crores will be incurred by us. In addition to that, we have developed coal corridors also in Talchi coal field, and we have future plan of developing Ib Valley Concrete Coal Corridor of 18.5 kilometer. And the cost will be 162 crores. And Basundra Concrete Coal Corridor, the length will be about 31 kilometers, and the cost will be 398 crores. 
So in this way, we are developing infrastructure for the evacuation of coal in the in this company. We are also heading towards making this company a zero energy company. For that, we require 200 megawatts of renewable energy sources to be developed. Out of this, two megawatt solar power plant has been installed and it is functioning. And 1.8 megawatt rooftop solar plant is under construction. And about and 50 megawatt solar plant is also under construction. And we plan to undertake 150 megawatt solar energy plant in future. With these words, I wish this conclave a grand success. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Singh, for a sneak peek to innovations in MCL in the age of digital technology. With that, we'll take a short break. Stay tuned, everyone.